Flip Flop Gaming. Flippy Flop. Woo! Yeah! Woo! 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 Hi, and welcome back to Flip Flop Gaming. Episode 4. Episode 4 of Guts and Glory again. And um, I'm going to dig into my food, so listen to the boys. Hi. <laughs> Stop. Oh, this one's really difficult. Oh, I know. Oh, God. I know this one. This one's the hot one. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I know how. Don't patronize me. Dan spent like an hour playing this a while ago and he just. He was got so angry. It's impossible. Well, I'm known as the calm one. Oh. Are you? I'm calm. I'm calm. I'm cool. I'm collected. I'm Dean. Shout out to everyone called Dean because life's hard. <laughs> Dean? Like Dean Martin. Yeah. He's dead. Dean sounds like so many words. Bean. Oh, I thought I had it. Oh, look at my nutsack, dude. Not you, Daniel. What's Daniel, stop! On? Daniel! <laughs> Allegedly. Just didn't want us to get into legal complications in episode one. I'm not in episode one now, so we're fine. We can talk about all the perverts we want. I'd rather we did not know. Your pervert email us. We'll get you on the show. And we'll send your details to the authorities. Dude, you're not supposed I to mean, say that. I mean, oh <laughs> no, we're that in was there. the point. I'm have a cop. But we'll advertise your movie. Whatever movie we have out now. John Lester. Uh, wait, didn't he get fired from Pixar? No, he stepped down. Which means Disney fired him. Wait, so what's happening with Toy Story 4? Because he's going to direct it. I don't know. It's a good question. It's a really important question. Well, I have to know, Toy Story 4, like, I mean... Firstly... It's going to be a while, anyway. Firstly, we didn't... It's coming out 2019, dude. What? Firstly, John Lasseter... No, no, no. We didn't need Toy Story 4, because Toy Story 3 was the best... Uh-huh, ending they could have had. I'm fine with them releasing shorts with mm. the characters in. But I mean, Toy Story 4 didn't need to happen. Also, John Lasseter, yeah, he made Toy Story, Toy Story 2, but Bugs Life is overrated, and Cars, Cars 2, are the worst. I think Bugs Life is barely rated when you put them in the scheme of Pixar films. Bugs Life is a fine... If it was by DreamWorks, it would have been a really good film. By but DreamWorks. They did Ants instead. Uh, a lot of people love Ants. Have you seen both Ants and Bugs Life? Yes. Well, which, which one do you prefer? I haven't seen Ants for a very long time, so I can't call it. Yeah, I was going to say, I saw Ants Firstly, probably like the year it came out. Bugs Life has Kevin Spacey, Ants has Woody Allen, so maybe don't make movies with Ants in there. And the Ant Bully has Nicolas Cage. So... Nothing wrong with Nicolas Cage? No, Nicolas Cage is playing Superman Teen Titans Go the movie. Seriously? Yeah, dude. That movie's coming out, like, next month. Sorry, this month. I didn't even know that. Yeah, no one's looking forward to it. But... Teen Titans Go sucks. The original Teen Titans, pretty good. Uh, if this uh, movie does well, Cartoon Network said they're gonna uh, do another se series of the original Teen Titans, which is pretty damn amazing. Does Teen Titans have that one that you fancy in it? Raven. Beast Boy. Raven. <laughs> Well, Beast Boy can turn to any animal, so are any of you into bestiality? I'm, I'm hoping for a Teen Titans movie set in the DCEU. They're doing a TV, live action TV series, right? Yeah. yeah. Right. Warner Brothers have had more success with their TV shows than their films. I don't like their TV shows. I like their movies because I like making fun of them. That's why I like The Mummy. Yeah. That's why I want the Universal Cinematic Universe to succeed. So I can laugh at it more. Maybe I'll release a review of it on my own personal channel that doesn't exist yet. You're leaving us already? No, I'm not pulling a John Tron, I'm pulling a Ninja Sex Pie who still make great content. 
I ain't gonna say racist slurs like John Tron. So no offense to John Tron. Yeah, Jafari. Yeah, what a good name though. He's of a certain ethnic background. He is something. He's something alright. Like, isn't he like part Italian? I don't know. That means he's allowed to say the end of It's true that black people in Italy, Mel. Have you not seen Call Me By Your Name? No, no I haven't. I, I don't think there's a black person there, but there is an Italy in it. <laughs> there's I, an Italy in it? Not the Italy. There's at least one Italy. <laughs> I didn't keep count of all Little the Italy. Little Italy. Little Lily. The Italy Tower of Italy. It has the guy from Shape of Water. The fish. The fish? No. The, Shout di the dude that does all the prosthetic gear. Shout out to Doug Jones though. That's the guy. I love that man. He was in Hellboy. He played Ape Safety. He was in... He's in so many things. Well... Someone else did the voice, but he was in the, the rubber suit. Yeah. You know he's in So you got a thing for like rubber suits then or something? Well, you know oh, how, allegedly. What Andy Circus does with um, motion capture, Doug Jones does with prosthetics. If you want a prosthetic man, get him. This level sucks. It does indeed. I'm not an angry man, I'm actually a Buddhist. Shout, shout out to Buddha. Because he's the only like religious guy that's fat, apart from. Oh. It's several different uh, versions. I like of the Buddha. fat one. I like the fat one. Laughing Buddha. Yeah, he's funny. Well, yeah, he's laughing. He's like the Obama of religious people. If Jerry Seinfeld was alive back then, Buddha would have been on Comedians Cars getting coffee. Jesus, will there be a little baby Jesus floating around in London? Get that Jesus out of here. Shout out to Jesus. Or, as the Mexicans say, Jesus. That's how they say Jesus. Not the Jesus. I think they call him Jesus. But when there's a little boy named Jesus, they say, Jesus. That won't race. Someone else do this shit. I fucking. I am I'm not. Done. You can skip to a different level. You don't have to do it. Fine. Anymore. Okay, fine. I'm a quitter, I guess. Fuck. Next I mean, track. Technically, you kind of work for it in if you're passing it on to someone else. No. We're a team. Oh. Don't. Okay. Oh, I'm so sorry. So sorry. Didn't well, the audience gets less to it. We get to experience everything. <laughs> I know. Well, I. Like, can we cut that out? No. That? Totally I'm... uncensored, unfiltered content. I'm a disgusting human being. And I'm Dean. <laughs> Right. <laughs> if we advertise right, then I might be known as like the nice one. Nice as in the least gross. Oh, at least gross for sure. I'm definitely gross. We're all different levels of gross. I wanted to be like the nice lady one, which is why I was hoping you'd edit out that part. Oh, but... you want to be the Susie? Yeah, um. Shout out um... to Susie. Obviously, we're big fans of the game we're on. Who? <laughs> um, Shout out, big fan of Game Gumps, except for you, Barry. Get out of all the videos, yeah, Barry. Barry. <laughs> you don't even edit anymore, yeah. Barry. Yeah, what are you even doing with the Gumps, Barry? Get a real job, Kevin Barry. Is, Kevin's the better editor. What about Matt and Ryan from Super Mega? I know them because they're clever with my phone. Alright, let's preference this. Uh, I love Barry. Barry's okay. Barry Kramer. <laughs> Mr. Kramer. Is his last name Kramer? Yes, yeah, Kramer. Dude! It's Kramer like... versus Kramer. Yeah. Shout out to Mel Street. Yes. Yeah. She is amazing. And she was also in Mamma Mia. Uh, I'm going to which... see the next Mamma Mia film soon. Which okay? is less amazing than... I... I'm not sure how I feel about the storyline in general. But okay, I do wait, 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 wait. Some good Abba songs. Before you start, before you start, um, before before you start reviewing Mamma Mia, I just want to remind everyone, Mel doesn't like Bill Murray. Okay, continue. I think we mentioned that in the first episode. Yeah, we mentioned this because Mel's a horrible human. It's not that I don't like Bill Murray. I Dude. never said I don't like him. I said I don't find him funny. Then why do you hate Lost in Translation? He's not even doing comedy in that. I. It kind of is. Mm. 
I it's not because of him. I just didn't get into Lost in Translation. It it's a very weird. slow movie. Well, exactly. See? You have to be like. It isn't the first shot. You have to Scarlett have a high. Hansen's butt. Yes, it is. Cool. I mean, I stayed for that. You have to have a high IQ to like Lost in Translation. Although. So this is just your way of saying I'm smart and you're not. No, only when it comes to film reviews. Okay, I mean, but um, you're a big film nerd. So. I'm the f- no, 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 there's the I, I'm a no. I'm kind of film nerd. Film nerds. Okay, no, there's two kind of film nerds. There's Dan, who likes Star Wars, and a Marvel. That's you as well, Mel. That's true. Don't get me wrong. I love Star Wars. Episode eight though, and but but you also I, really appreciate classic films as well. I love classic horrors. Well, for sure. If you give yeah. me a nineteen twenties horror, I, I'm all over that shit. Yeah. But you. You're all over that shit, like Stank. I'm the <laughs> guy that knows obscure Italian movies from the seventies. You're the guy that. Shout knows, out to the mirror. Like, Great film. <laughs> you're the one who knows like every Oscar Best Picture winner uh, yeah. and probably nomination. I can like, um, ever. If you name any movie, I'd probably say. The year it was always. I think that's it for the episode. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to leave it there. What's the Christy short episode? Christy McMark, ZZ Top is my dad, same as <gasps> ZZ Top. ZZ Top, love ZZ Top. Someone yelled at me because I called Dragon Ball Z Dragon Ball Z. Like, it's not Dragon Ball Z, it's Dragon Ball Z. I'm like, well, I'm British, I speak the Queen's tongue. It's not my fault that those Japanese cartoons don't know how to pronounce the letters correctly. That's not me being racist. I could go for the Queen's tongue right now. Shout out to JZ. <laughs> Uh, okay, so I guess we are leaving it there after I could go for the Queen's time. And um, we will see you in the next episode. Love you. Bye. Uh.